Der Rosengarten zu Worms, the rose garden at Worms, sometimes called der Gross Rosengarten, the big rose garden, to differentiate it from der Klein Rosengarten, Lauren, and often simply called the Rosengarten, is an anonymous 13th century Middle High German heroic poem in the cycle of Dietrich von Bern. The Rosengarten may have been written as early as before 1250, but is securely attested by around 1300. It is unclear where it was written. While it combines characters from the traditions of the Nibelungenlied, Walter of Aquitaine, and the Dietrich cycle, the Rosengarten is usually considered one of the so called fantastical, adventure haft, poems about Dietrich. These poems more closely resemble a courtly romance than traditional heroic epic. Occasionally, because it features Dietrich fighting against human opponents rather than giants or dwarfs, it is grouped together with the similar poem by Ralph Uendi Diet Life as a separate group of Dietrich poems. Scholars count four or five versions of the Rosengarten. The poem concerns a fight between the heroes of the cycle around Dietrich von Bern with those from the Nibelungen saga, which takes place in a rose garden at the city of Worms. The fight is motivated by Kriemhild's desire to test the mettle of her fiancé Siegfried against Dietrich von Bern. In the end, Dietrich and his warriors defeat the Burgundians including Siegfried. The poem is conventionally seen as a condemnation of Kriemhild and by extension her role in the Nibelungenlied. It is often further understood as a meta-literary text discussing the nature of heroic poetry. The Rosengarten was a very popular poem and was included in the printed Heldenbuch, bringing its transmission into the 16th century. Der Rosengarten zu Worms, the Rose Garden at Worms, sometimes called der Gross Rosengarten, the Big Rose Garden, to differentiate it from der Klein Rosengarten, Lauren, and often simply called the Rosengarten is an anonymous 13th-century Middle High German heroic poem in the cycle of Dietrich von Bern. The Rosengarten may have been written as early as before 1250, but is securely attested by around 1300. It is unclear where it was written. While it combines characters from the traditions of the Nibelungenlied, Walter of Aquitaine, and the Dietrich cycle, the Rosengarten is usually considered one of the so-called fantastical, adventure haft, poems about Dietrich, these poems more closely resembles a courtly romance than traditional heroic epic. Occasionally, because it features Dietrich fighting against human opponents rather than giants or dwarfs, it is grouped together with the similar poem by Ralf Uendi Diet Life as a separate group of Dietrich poems. Scholars count four or five versions of the Rosengarten. The poem concerns a fight between the heroes of the cycle around Dietrich von Bern with those from the Nibelungen saga, which takes place in a rose garden at the city of Worms. The fight is motivated by Kriemhild's desire to test the mettle of her fiancé Siegfried against Dietrich von Bern. In the end, Dietrich and his warriors defeat the Burgundians including Siegfried. The poem is conventionally seen as a condemnation of Kriemhild and by extension her role in the Nibelungenlied. It is often further understood as a meta-literary text discussing the nature of heroic poetry. The Rosengarten was a very popular poem and was included in the printed Heldenbuch, bringing its transmission into the 16th century, the Rosengarten is conventionally dated to the first half of the 13th century, partially due to its close relationship to the poem by Ralph Uendi Dientlieb. The first manuscript of the text only come from the beginning of the 14th century, however, and the earliest mention of the work is in Ottokar's A.U.S. Der Gallsteirische Reim Chronik, comparing King Ottokar II of Bohemia's prowess in battle to that shown by Dietrich fighting Siegfried in the Rose Garden. It is unclear where the poem may have been written. As with almost all German heroic epic, it is anonymous. Point five overarching versions of the Rosengarten are usually recognized: A, D, P, F, C, and a middle low German version. Version F is fragmentary, while C represents a mixture of A and D P. Version A can be further subdivided into an older Vulgate version, a younger Vulgate version, and the Dresdner version. Version D P can be further subdivided into versions D and P, with P being a shorter version of D. Version A has around 390 stanzas. Version D around 633. Given the great variability between manuscripts, each individual attested text can also be considered a version. Manuscripts of version A, older Vulgate version, are R4, A8, DN, A 14th century, lost. Preserved in a transcription. R10, Stat Bibliothek des Out, H.S. George. 224 4 degrees. Paper, 1422, from Trier. Contains various poems and rhyming couplets, including the Rosengarten in Lorraine. R11, A8, M, formerly Bayerisch Staatsbibliothek Munich, CGM 429. Lost. Paper, 
middle of 15th century, from Augsburg. Contains a romance by der Stricker and the Rosengarten. R12, AC, B. Stocksbibliothek Berlin, Miss Germ. 4 degrees 744. Paper, 1453, Central German Dialect. R17, A8, D. Sachsisch Landesbibliothek Dresden, MSCM 56. Paper, 1489, from Augsburg. Romance by der Stricker in Rosengarten. R20, Bibliotheca Jagiellonska Krakow, Beryl. Miss Germ. 4 degrees 1497. Paper, 15th century, Upper German or Middle German dialect. Contains various spiritual texts, also Loren and the Rosengarten. Version A, Younger Vulgate version exists in six printings of the Heldenbuch. Version A, Dresner version. R14, B, SS Dresner Heldenbuch. Sachsisch Landesbibliothek Dresden, MSCN 201. Paper, 1472, from Nuremberg. Version DP, Vulgate version D. R8, K. Kondjelich Bibliothek Copenhagen, Fragmentary 18 at Parchment, 15th century, Bavarian dialect. Fragmentary, contains various texts, including the Rosengarten in Virginal. R9, Di. H. Universitats Bibliothek Heidelberg, CPG 359. Paper, around 1420, from Alsace. Contains various texts. R15, DC, S1, Second Strasbourg Heldenbuch. Formerly City Library slash Hospital or Library Strasbourg, COD. B81. Destroyed in 1870. R16, DB, S Heldenbuch von Diebold von Hanno. Formerly Strasbourg City slash Seminary Library, destroyed 1870. R18, DD, B1, Staatsbibliothek Berlin. Ms. Germ 4 degrees 577. Fragment of a paper manuscript, turn of the 16th century, Central German dialect. DP, version P. R5, T. Narodny Museum, Prague, Cod. IEA 3. Fragment of a parchment manuscript, first half of the 14th century. From Bohemia. R6, DC, P. Graf Donskonborn Schlossbibliothek Pommersfelden, Cod. 54, paper, middle of 14th century, from Erfurt. Contains various poems in rhyming couplets, including the Rosengarten zu Worms and Lorin. Version F. R1, F2, Nirodny Nihadnesesk Republiki Prague, Fragm. Cherm. 5, fragment of a parchment manuscript, first half of the 14th century, Central German dialect. R2, F, B, F3, Staatsbibliothek Berlin. Nachlass Grimmend R131,4. Fragment of a parchment manuscript, beginning of 14th century, Central German dialect. R3, D, F1, formerly Danzig, Stadtbibliothek Miss 2412. Lost. Fragment of a parchment manuscript, 14th century, Central German dialect. Version C. R7, C, F. Stotuen die Universitätsbibliothek Frankfurt am Main, Miss Germ. 4 degrees 2. Stat in the Universitax Bibliothek Frankfurt and Main, Miss Germ. 4 degrees 2. Paper, second half of the 14th century, Rhine Franconian dialect. Contains various texts in rhyming couplets, including the Rosengarten and Lorin. Low German version. R13, Graf Donskonborn Schloss Bibliothek Pommersfelden, Cod. 5, paper, 1470, Low German dialect. Contains Bertold von Holly's crane in the beginning of the Rosengarten. Fragments unassigned to any version. R19, fragment, found in Staatsbibliothek Berlin, Miss Theologie Let. 2 degrees 82. Parchment, first third of the 14th century, Central German dialect. R21, Pfarrarchiv Kempen, H44. Fragment of a parchment manuscript, first half of the 14th century, Low German. The Rosengarten has long been read as a meta-literary text about German heroic poetry, with Michael Kirschman calling it poetry about heroic poetry, Dietron über Heldendichtung. The poem contains numerous citations and allusions to various heroic traditions via objects such as swords and horses, as well as the names of various heroes. Victor Mella takes the poem's mixing of various elements from other texts that could not occur at the same time as a sign of its citation of other heroic poems in order to comment on them. Version D. Moreover, cites or reverses many motifs of the historical Dietrich epics Dietrich's Flut and the Rabenschlatt, Etzel seeks Dietrich, 
a reversal of Dietrich's exile at Etzel's court, and Dietrich increases Etzel's power by forcing Jibik to become his vassal. Whitage, moreover, receives his horse Sheming and also asks to leave Dietrich's service due to Wolf Hart's anger over this gift, foreshadowing his treachery and escape on Sheming in the Rabenschlacht. The text also contains an explicit allusion to Whitehead's role in Alfarts. Especially important for understanding the text is its portrayal of Kriemhild. She plays the role of a ruling courtly lady as found in courtly romance, and in this role she is criticized as hubristic and proud. The use of the rose garden as the place of combat, whatever its original significance, also seems a clear citation of courtly adventure. In version A, she seems justly punished by Ilsen's many rough kisses that cause her to bleed. The poem also clarifies a problem left unanswered in the Nibelungenlied, by portraying Kriemhild and Siegfried in a negative light, the text marks Kriemhild as a villain in the Nibelungenlied as well. Version DP, on the hand, satirizes many elements of the Nibelungenlied. In this version, Kriemhild is most heavily criticized by the Burgundians rather than Dietrich's men. Millet suggests that the rivalry between heroes from western part, the Burgundians, and the southeastern part, Dietrich's men, of the German-speaking area may reflect real political struggles between these two areas, as well as a cultural rivalry between Rhinelandish courtliness and a less idealistic Austrian and Bavarian ideal of heroism. The figure of Ilsen and the other monks may be intended to criticize the state of monastic life at the time of the poem's composition. All versions of the poem contain numerous comical elements. The Rosengarten is composed, like most German heroic poems, in stanzas. The stanza used in the Rosengarten is the so-called Hildebrandston, a variant of the stanza used in the Nibelungenlied in which all the lines are of the same length. Each line consists of three metrical feet, a sejura, and three additional feet. The following example from Alfarts Dodd can illustrate. Also der Liechte Morgan and den Heimel kam. Der Stand VFFN YT Sorgen der Forst Lobsam. Der Diegen Kung, ALS Jean die Sorg Betzwang. One JM die Held Kiemen. Die Weil was J.M. Lang. Several versions use a variant of the stanza called the Hunenweis or Hunenweis, the Hunnish melody, in which there are always rhymes at the midline sejura. This variant can also be understood to be made up of eight short verses, taking the sejuras as line endings. A connection between this poem and Dietrich's encounter with Siegfried in the Thedrexiga is sometimes speculated upon. In the Thedrexiga, Thydrek fights against Sigurd during his campaign in Bertangenland an event possibly also referenced in the virginal. Thydrak goes to that country with twelve warriors, and is challenged by twelve native warriors in turn. Thydrak fights Sigurd, breaking his horn skin by borrowing Wigga, Whitage, as sword mending. Following the defeat, Sigurd becomes one of Thydrak's men. If any connection exists between this episode and the Rosengarten then either the author of the Thydrak's knew of the Rosengarten and altered it for his work, meaning that the Rosengarten existed in the early 13th century, or there was an even older tale of Dietrich's encounter with Siegfried which diverged into the story found in the Thedrexiga and that of the Rosengarten. Another version of Siegfried's defeat by Dietrich is recounted in the Ravenschlacht. Michael Kirschman has suggested a common oral source for both. The Heldenbu Prosa reports that Dietrich killed Siegfried in the Rose Garden, suggesting that this was another variant of the story in circulation. In terms of the oral tradition, it is notable that Kriemhild and Gunther's father has the name Jibik, corresponding to the Norse tradition. Das Leid von Hern und Siefried, and the Walfarius, which in the Nibelungenlied has been replaced by another name. This suggests that the poet knew an oral tradition independent of the written Nibelungenlied, although the author clearly alludes to various aspects of that poem and even cites various lines. The location of the battle in a rose garden may have been influenced by the similar use of a rose garden in Lauren. The use of the rose garden is also suggestive of courtly romance. Heinzel also notes that there are various reports of tournaments and medieval worms taking place in rose gardens, which either inspired the location in the poem or else were imitating it. A newer suggestion is that the rose garden is a corruption of the name Rosegard, meaning Russian city, and could be connected to the numerous allusions to Dietrich's battles against Russians or Slavs, see Dietrich und Wenneslin, found in German heroic tradition, and which are narrated in the Thedrexiga. The Rosengarten likely inspired the similar bite Rolf und Dietlieb, another heroic poem that may date from the 13th century. A scene in the Rabenschlacht in which Siegfried and Dietrich fight may also have been inspired by the poem. The Rosengarten was included in the popular early modern printed Heldenbuch, thereby assuring its transmission until 1600. The Rosengarten was translated into Czech in the 14th century. Only fragments survive of this translation. 
The story was also reworked into a play in the 15th century, although the earliest extant copies date from the 16th century. The Rosengarten, likely is known from the Heldenbuch, was also reworked into an episode of Hans Sachs's tragedy about the life of Siegfried, Der Hern and Sofrit in 1557. Leonard, Elizabeth, Kurth, Sonia, Nirens, Svengia, eds, 2015. Rosengarten. Text UN die Studien zur Mittelhochdeutschen Heldenepoch, 3 vols. Berlin, de Gruder. ISBN 978-3-11-0367867.Holes, George, Ed. 1893, Diagedicht vom Rosengarten zu Worms. Halley, Niemeyer. Retrieved April 10, 2018. Weber, Henry William, Jameson, Robert, Scott, Walter, 1814. Of the Garden of Roses at Worms. Illustrations of Northern Antiquities from the Earlier Teutonic and Scandinavian Romances, being an abstract of the Book of Heroes in Nibelungenle, with translations from the Old German, Danish, Swedish, and Icelandic languages, with notes and dissertations. Edinburgh, Longman, Hurst, Rees, Orne, and Brown. Pages 137 to 149. Retrieved April 8, 2018. Simrock, Carl, 1859. Der Rosengarten. Dodge Klein Heldenbuch. Stuttgart, Dogsburg, Kata. Pages 245 to 355. Retrieved April 10, 2018. Heidelberg, University Library, CPG 359. MSR 9. Dresden, State Library, MSCR M56, MSR 17. Dresden, State Library, MSCR M201, The Dresden Heldenbuch, MSR 14.